Hello, hello. Hello, how are you? Hello, guys. Can you listen to me? Hello. Ruth, Miguel, can you listen to me? No? No. Yes, teacher. Come on. I thought uh, I was like, I think uh, my head is not working, but I can see it is. So welcome. It's nice to see you guys. Okay. Welcome to our first session. I really hope you guys are ready to start this class today. And uh, how do you feel? How are you doing? Very well. Very well. I'm good. Glad. Good. Awesome. Uh, is that Gilbert or Gilbert? How do you pronounce your name? Um, I prefer Gil. Mm -hmm. You prefer Gilbert. Okay, nice. So how do you, um, how was your day? How was your Monday? Easy, busy, tiring. How was Fine. It? Fine. fine. It was fine. fine. I'm glad. I'm glad to hear that. Mm -hmm. Okay. And what about your 2022? How is it so far? Albert? Very well until now. <laughs> nice to hear that. Yeah, I'm glad. It so far, so good. No complaints. Okay, great. Well, welcome, guys. For me, it's a real um, honor to be here so we can practice English, so we can learn English. That is the idea, okay? Welcome. I really want to get to know you a little bit. I want you to talk to me about you. Maybe you want to share something special about you that we, want, that we all want to know. And uh, let's see, we are 21 connected. So that means that you are 20 plus myself. Let me see. I'm gonna start sharing my screen. So you can start taking a look at it. Give me a second. Let's see, here we go. This is pre-intermediate one. Hmm, interesting. So you, uh, that tells me that you know how to speak English. Am I right? Guys, hello. Can you guys see my screen? Can you see my screen? Yes, 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 yes I, I see. see. Pre intermediate, right? So this is really awesome. I want to know something about you. So my first activity is uh, this one. Get to know, getting to know each other. So say, hey, good evening, say hi, and briefly introduce yourself. Maybe we're not gonna have um, that much time. So please be brief. Mention the most important things about you and tell us how you want to be called, okay? And if you have any expectation about this course, please go ahead and say it. Who wants to start volunteering? Anybody? Raise your hand and participate, please. Hi, I want to participate about present myself. Thank you. Go ahead. Okay, hi, my name is Carla Tatiana. I am 28 years old. Uh, I am studying English right now because I uh, use for this to give a good opportunity to, in, to increase my English. Great, Carla. I am so happy to hear that. I'm glad you are taking this opportunity. I'm glad you are taking this advantage. I promise we are going to do whatever is needed for you to keep practicing, okay? okay? I think, thank you for your participation. David, go ahead, David, please. Good night, everybody. Uh, I am 40 years old. I am to Merapan City, Santa Ana. I am a singer, a teacher, and it's a pleasure and privilege to stay in the English class. Only that. 
That is great. <laughs> you are a teacher, so we are colleagues. That's really good, David. Nice. So anybody else? I think I have Miguel. Miguel? Uh, good night. Uh, my name is Alfonso Miguel Guardado. And I live in San Salvador. Um, I would like to, to learn English because uh, I need to, to learn English by, by my job. And I give opportunity in, in <clears throat> commercio exterior, in business international. Uh, my expectation is uh, learn English for, uh, uh, I, I need to, to, to talk English very well because um, I need to, to be as um, business in English and this is my expectation. You yeah. will do it, Miguel. You will do it because you have the right attitude and that what it really matters, okay? So I, I don't doubt you will do it. So you have the right attitude you have the right uh let's see opportunity to do it so welcome to this course let's see uh kim kimberly hi good night uh, my name is kimberly i am from ilopango i am 23 years old and my expectation is uh, i want to improve my english so thank you you will. I know you will. You speak really good. Good. Anybody else? Go. Go ahead, please. Oh, I want to introduce myself. Okay, well, uh, my name is Emerson Inglés. I'm 22 years old. And I'm from Ciudad Arce, eh, en la, en la Libertad. And my expectation for about this course is that we are going to learn uh, many things in English. That's all. Thank you. Awesome. Yeah, I'm glad to hear that, Emerson. Welcome. And of course, we're going to practice. Okay, that's the idea. And I would say if you have the attitude you want to learn, we have this blessing, we have the technology in our hands, we have access to platforms in here, you have, uh, you know, the technology, let's say internet, a lot of things that, that are easy to access so you can practice. So welcome to these sessions. Anybody else who wants to participate, guys, we are 20 eight so there are many people connected that's really cool so any other participation me thank you so much go ahead uh my name is gilbert gonzalez i am from sonsonate and, and well i'm 30 years old i can't speak the language very well but that's why I'm here. Uh, I need to improve my uh, speaking because I really, really need to uh, find a job that can uh, give me more earnings. And that's my expectation. Uh, learn to speak it very, very well like a native and, and find a new job that can give me the best improve millions of dollars <laughs> yeah <laughs> <laughs> you know what that's really cool i'm glad to hear you know your motivation guys when you have a motivation that's what keep us you know forward that what really 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 um help us you know so in your case, Gilbert, I know you will do it, okay? Getting a, a better job, of course, maybe speaking English will open doors and that's something that we all know, right? When you speak the language, you may travel, you might want to apply for scholarships and you know, you, you never know, right? So I'm glad. Uh, who else wants to participate? Okay, thank you, go ahead. No. Hello, everyone. My name is Franklin Romero. Um, you can call me Frank. So 
I'm here because I like English and I would like to speak with another person and I would like to learn English because I would like to travel to another country. Nice, Franklin. I'm glad. Yeah, if you speak the language, it might not only be United States, it can be other countries like Europe. And they speak English. Yeah. Even if you go to China, you know, English is universal. English is found not only here, like in America, but also in other, you know, uh, continents, right? So that's cool. Yeah. I'm glad. I'm glad you have the vision. Okay. And I'm glad to hear that. Anybody else, guys? 28 students connect. Come on. Break the ice. Don't be shy. Speak your English. That's what that's what we want to hear. We make mistakes. Always say. Raise your hand. I don't see anybody. Come on. Maybe I want to choose some. Hmm. If you are really angry, let me see your face. I can see some faces that are really good. Ah, who wants to participate? I like when, when people, okay, let's see. There are many people connected. Maybe um, you don't want to participate. And so I, I have heard like maybe only three or five and I don't like that. I want everybody to participate. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to create small groups, maybe two minutes, take advantage of the time. And then please make sure you talk to the people you are assigned, okay? And choose yourself, say your name, say um, if you have, a, I don't know, any expectation or what you do on a daily basis and stuff like that. So not much time, maybe only three minutes or less, like I said. And here we go. I'm going to create some small room. You're going to receive the the invitation in a minute. Here we go. Three minutes. Hello, Ruth. You stay with me here. Hello, hello. 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 Hello, Noemi. People are talking in the rooms and you are with me here. Speak to me. Hello, Olivia. Buenas noches. Eh, tengo una conexión, entonces me, me de en otro dispositivo volví a entrar. Eh, estaba eh, enviando a los a los a los salones. Uh -huh. Y no recuerdo en cuál iba. It's okay. I'm about to close the rooms. I'm about to close them. Ahorita lo voy a cerrar todo. Solo eran dos minutos para ver si alguien hablaba más. Ok, ya voy a cerrarlo ahorita. Sí, no escuché nada desde la clase. Porque sí, It's no okay. escuchaba nada. It's okay. It's okay. Ya vamos a esperar que vengan todos. Ok. They're coming. Ok. I gave you three minutes. I don't know if you were able to speak or you had to listen to somebody else speaking because I only made three groups. <laughs> the idea was that at least one more will 
speak. I don't know if I if if you had a chance. Yeah, teacher. I am um, I I excuse me, but um estoy enferma la garganta, tuve que hablar, pero si te conectaba la clase. No problem, no problem. Yeah, I'm glad, I'm glad. I'm glad you are connected and I'm sorry to hear you are sick. Really hope you get better. Okay, no problem. If you want to just keep remain there listening, it's fine. The class is also being recorded. Okay, so welcome guys. I know I gave you only three minutes, like I promised. If you were able to speak, you were lucky. If you were not able to speak, maybe in another time you will speak, okay? But then the idea is that you break the ice and say, I wanna start talking this group. And the groups were only three groups because um, you know, 10, 10, 10, I said, okay. Maybe if you spoke, also, if you didn't, next time. So thank you so much guys for um, returning to the main session. We are going to start with our first activity. And our first activity is, let's see, give me a second here. Some things that I want to go over before we start. Let's see, Emerson, help me please read the first two rules. Let's call it like that. Okay, Mr. Uh, rules and expectations. Number one, act, act, active participation. Number two, clarify your doubts. And number three, raise your hand to participate. Number four, use reactions and chat. And the last one is mute your mic when I can see it. We're not talking. Okay, uh -huh. yes. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Good pronunciation, Emerson. Appreciate it. Yes, okay, whenever you want to participate, please raise your hand, say it, so, so that makes it more organized, okay? And then reactions, in case there's something you like from anybody's participation, just go ahead and use reactions. You have reactions like, um, what, which one, which are the most common, like, if you like, if you like it, if you uh, feel like, um, as if this was really nice, um, idea you want to maybe say uh, not a like but a heart saying that you love it sounds sound like that use reactions and please if you're not talking mute your mic so there's no interference on the on the on the session all right let's see we're gonna start we have um, this is the calendar guys we are gonna be here for four weeks right and then we have secciones or sections one, two, three, uh, first two weeks, we have a midterm test, we have section four, and then we have a final test. It is, I think you are familiar, but if you are not familiar, let me tell you that it's necessary for you to um, pass this course to, uh, to attend or to uh, interact on the platform, at least an 80%. You might be saying, but this is too much, or this is uh, a lot, of uh, percentage, but I will say, guys, please try to exceed what we request. So don't be happy with an 80, go for more. You try to hit a 9 or 90 percent or above, okay? So that must be your uh, vision or your mission or your objective, okay? So basically, this is the calendar Be uh, for you to have an idea in how we're going to be working, okay? I think um, this is also on your platform. I want to have, I want to maybe ask a question. Do you all have access to the platform or do you have problems accessing to the platform? If you have access to the platform, please send me on the chat one, uh, uh, maybe a message saying I'm ready. Uh, but if you have, uh, I mean, if you don't have problems, say I'm ready. But if you have problems, maybe send me a WhatsApp and tell him, hey, you know, I have problems access to the platform so I can report it. But then I want to know if the majority here has uh, access. Mm -hmm. Send me a chat, say anything that you can tell, you already, and you have already access. Thank you, Gilbert, for confirming. So you're ready on the platform. Mm -hmm. What else? Who else? Only Gilbert. Who else is ready? Well, 
Pudiste. Send me a message. Send me sorry, a message. sorry, sorry. It's okay. Sorry. Send me a message saying if you, uh huh, David. Okay. Put this in, David. Do you have anything to say? No, I am ready in the platform. Okay, thank you. <clears throat> we have three people who have confirmed. And what about the other ones? Do you have access to the platform, guys? Yes, Mister. You yes. do. Okay, great have people saying ready why am i asking this because it's so important you have access to it and then in case you maybe forget your password or you have issues please let us know because we have people working for, you know on this for you so we have many people confirming now thank you so much yeah Ruth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay thank you gabriela all right, good. Now that you have you have told me that you're ready, you have access to it. I want to know who has seen the first topic, the first the first uh, content. What is it? What is it? Tell me, please. What is the first session about? Franklin, go ahead, Franklin. What is our name? Okay. Yeah. What is? Mm -hmm. Name. The first session. The first session is homework. Please call me back for for questions. Okay, good. I can see you have already watched the video. Great. What did you learn it's on this? Our topic? presentation. Your presentations. Okay, introducing yourself. Okay, good. What else do you remember? What else? What did you learn on this session? Any expression or any vocabulary, or maybe it was just a practice because you already knew about it. What did you learn? Any expressions or any word you learned? Yeah. Hey, where are you from? Where are you from? Okay. What the else? Age. The and age. age. Okay. I think just only that. Okay. Good. Basically, you practice something you already know, right? You already know how to say. Okay. Great. If you guys have an access to watch this session, please do it. So you come to the sessions because we only have 60 minutes and this is very little. And you, you bring your questions. You say, hey, teacher, you know, there's this word. I don't know how to pronounce it. Or there's this session, this part in this uh, a specific part of the test. I don't know how to answer this. And then I'm going to be helping you out. The purpose is that we practice here, that we clarify questions on this session. Okay, keep that in mind. And um, what else? Let's see. So let, let's start session number one. Welcome. I really hope you're ready to learn and practice as much as possible. Let's see. Our first one is this one. The conversation, as somebody said, please call me Beth. Conversation number one. And um, this is the objective. This is only one. Gabriela, can you please help me reading the, the objective? information participants we learn how to introduce tinsel and other be listening to a conversation between two people who just meet and are introducing each other thank you so much what is the question we ask when we want somebody to introduce him or, or herself what do we ask The name. Okay, you ask the name. Is there any specific question you ask when you want somebody to to introduce themselves, like provide all details about personal information? Imagine you are human resources. You are the interviewer. What is the question you ask? Hello, how are you? Where do you come from? Okay, and is there any question we ask that involve everything, Franklin? Ruth? What's your name? What's your name? Okay. If I ask what's your name, it's okay, but it's very specific. What, what is the question I ask, general question that include all this information? Let's see. Who knows? Hello. 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 H
is when you uh -huh. ask someone tell me about yourself. I don't know. Exactly. That's the one. Do me oh, a can favor. You tell me about you. Exactly. Franklin and Emerson, send those questions on the chat, please. Send them so your classmate okay. gets to know this question. And please, on your notebook, guys, write it down. Because that is the question somebody will ask you when they want you to introduce yourself. And when we say introduce yourself, we mean tell me about yourself. Exactly, Emerson. But can you tell me about you? These two questions are the one, if I ask Jacqueline, Jacqueline, tell me about yourself. And then Jacqueline must start talking uh, her age, where she lives, what she does, uh, her expectations, her <coughs> plans, and blah, blah, blah. So the question, tell me about yourself. And it's um, a question in which we want people to talk. Uh, Miguel Guardado, hello, what about you? What about you, Miguel, is a question that you use when you have previously mentioned something. For example, hey, uh, how are you? I'm good, what about you? In that case, we use what about you? Or for example, um, I love pupusas, what about you? Then what about you is only and you, so it's not the same. The two ones that we want to use are, tell me about you, tell me about yourself, or can you tell me about yourself or can you tell me about you basically these are the two ones the most common now uh, let me ask some of you luis uh, argumedo tell me about yourself Luis, do you have issues with your mic? Luis, we can, I cannot listen to you, Luis. Sorry, no problem, Luis. Try to fix your audio. Let me go back uh, with you in a minute. Oh, Jacqueline, you raise your hand, Jacqueline. I tell, mm -hmm. voy a hablar de mí. <laughs> All right, yes, go ahead. You have one minute or less. Speak, please. Okay, my name is Jacqueline Lourdes. Uh -huh. I like uh, que me llamen solo Lourdes. Uh -huh. My years old is 23. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I study in medicine. Uh -huh. I am from uh, San Marcos. Uh -huh. Only that. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, okay, good. Let's see. Tell me, tell me about yourself, tell me. Hi, um, good evening. Uh, my name is uh, Delmi Roxana Vasquez Montejo. Um, I'm 33 years old. I'm um, from in Santa Ana. Solamente. Only that, okay, good. Uh, Miguel Guardado. Hey, uh, my name is Alfonso Miguel Guardado. I live in, in San Salvador. And uh, I like to play soccer and swing. And I I 42 years old. I married and I, I job in like teacher in university in um, import export um, only that nice so you're a teacher at the university you're a professor nice good i'm glad to hear that let's see jacqueline lourdes tell me about yourself jacqueline your mic Hello. Hello, Jacqueline. Tell me about yourself. My name is Jacqueline. I like to be called Lourdes. I am 13, 23 years old. I study medicine. I am from San Marcos. Solamente. Only that. So you're going to be a doctor. Nice, Jacqueline. <laughs> Okay, let's see who else wants to volunteer. Emerson, tell me about yourself, Emerson. I am your interviewer. Tell me about yourself. I want to listen to you. 
Well, as I mentioned before, my name is Emerson Inglés. I'm 22 years old and I'm from Sudarse. Um, I'm charismatic and cheerful person and I always uh, try to see the best side of life and do the best I can in any situation. And also I'm someone who likes to uh, spend time with my family and my friends. I love uh, going out going out with my friend to different places of the Salvador. And I'm very sociable, that's all, thank you. What is the last place you have visited this year? Uh, I remember uh, um, the last weekend, uh, we went to the, the La Playa El Tunco. What do you, you like know? the most about it? Yeah. Um, well, uh, about this place. Yes. Well, uh, I like the environment. I like to, well, definitely I liked uh, going there with my friends. And uh, we like to visit this place because uh, uh, we are going, we like to dance and we like to go to the discotheque to dance with my friends. And sometimes uh, we, uh, I go to there with my family, but I just do it to eat seafood. I like it. That's okay, all. good, good. And I might have other questions for you, but then because of time, I'm going to stop right here. You're doing okay. really good, Emerson. I like, I like it. Okay, thank you so much. Good. Uh, whenever you, are, you guys are asked this question, this is what you have to, uh, let's say, whenever you are asked this question, try to expand, okay? as much as possible, okay? Don't only say my name, I am, I am uh, 11 years old, and that's it. So try to expand, try to provide as much as um, information as possible, okay? If you can provide details, that'll be great, okay? So this is the challenge I have for you. Tomorrow, you guys are going to introduce yourself, but I want you to write down a lot, maybe a half page about you, and have it ready because tomorrow you're gonna say it to me and to the class, okay? So write it down, this is extra homework. Tomorrow I'm going to choose some of you to introduce yourself. And don't only say to me, I am Armando, I am 32 years old, I love English. No, I want you to speak more than that, okay? Is that clear? Do you guys accept this challenge for tomorrow? Yes. Okay. Yeah, Tomorrow, I yes, say, when I say, okay, Miguel, tell me about yourself. And then Miguel says, yes, my name is Miguel. I am very optimistic. I love going now because my friends and I love Patty and blah, 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 blah. So you want to speak a lot. So for tomorrow, that's your first challenge, okay? Try to write as much as possible and try to have it like ready for tomorrow because we need to move on. Today, we have this uh, conversation practice, and I want to start with, with it. We have a uh, conversation practice, and, and I know you have already maybe um, listened to the one we have on the, on the platform, and uh, let's practice with this, okay? We have hello. What do we, how do we you know, complete this conversation? Who wants to help me? What is missing here? How can we do it? Franklin, go ahead. Hello, I'm Franklin. I'm 25 years old. Um, Continue to a man. Another you. person or yourself. Yes. You are okay. a double Hi, role. My name is okay. Hi, my name is Jefferson. So where are you from? Um, I'm from El Salvador. Um, in this session, <clears throat> um, what, a, what about you? Yeah. There's a blank here. I'm from El Salvador. What about you? And then? Oh, I don't remember what is the word in this part. It's okay. It's okay. It's, it's okay. your version. It's your version this time. 
Is that again? Tell, in, me, oh, okay. tell me, maybe. Tell me what about you. Mm, no. No. Yeah. Well, I love play trumpet. It's really awesome. And thanks. So it's <laughs> okay. Good. good. I like it. I like it. I want to hear more. Anybody else want to do a monologue like you yourself? Anybody else? Okay, Miguel, go ahead. That's the attitude. Hello, I am Miguel. And I, I, I am 42 years old. Uh, hi, my name is um, David. Where are you from? I'm from El Salvador. Uh, how about you? Uh, I don't understand this question. Um, I love it. Uh, play soccer. And it's really uh, uh, emotion uh, is 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 too hard and sense so it's good. Okay, all right. I like you know these are your versions and it's totally fine. I'm not saying this is incorrect because basically the idea is that if it makes sense, it's okay. So is there anybody else who would like to try? Maybe we can change what it says, I love, what can we say here? It's really, and so is. So is there anybody else who wants to try? Mm -hmm. One more, we are 30 connected, come on. Just try to fill the blanks. One more, one more, only one, come on. Or should I choose it? What, how about you? What about you? <clears throat> huh? How about you? Okay, I am. Go ahead, please. Yes, David, try. Okay, hello. Hello, I am David. I am 40 years old. Hi, my name is David. Where are you from? I am from Metapan City. Uh, what hard about you? Uh, I am a teacher. I love basketball. It's really nice sports. Uh, thanks. So it's only that. Okay. You see, we have other information added. So this is what we're gonna do. Uh, maybe you want to get this. Is this is just you know just the idea. But then if you want to add more and or remove, that's fine. So I'm going to create pairs and I want you to use this structure to make your own way, your own style, and then try to practice. And then when we come back, I'm going to choose for some of you to participate, okay? So maybe you want to screenshot this and have it ready to work with your partner. You're gonna have only like three or four minutes, no, not much, but get ready. This time is gonna be in pairs. Okay, so uh, take a picture of it, maybe. I'll give you uh, some seconds. You have it? Okay, here we go. Practice if you have no partner where you are and then you want to come back to the main room, I'm going to be here waiting for you, okay? So if there are no, uh, if in case there isn't anybody with you. So let's see, one second, it's going to be, here we go. Practice, practice please. Three minutes.
Okay, all right, all right. So did you practice? Albert, did you practice? Did you have a partner? I am, yes, you did? Yes, I am. Okay, I am assuming all of you practice because I gave you four minutes, four, because nobody returned. Nadia regresó. So I was waiting here, so I am thinking everybody practice, right? So I can choose anybody and listen, if you don't remember the structure, fine, improvise it, okay? Not teacher, I don't remember, I don't remember the, the conversation, but it's okay, improvise, improvise. Hey, how are you? Yeah, I'm doing good, what are you doing? And blah, 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 try to improvise if you don't remember the structure, because I'm not going to display it. So let's see, I want to hear a couple of you practicing. Volunteers, anybody? Many hands up, wow. David, thank you, David. Who's your partner, David? Your partner? David's partner? Maybe your mic. Davy's partner, come on. Who is it? Davy, what is your partner's name? Your mic, Davy. Davy, your mic, I cannot hear you. Your microphone is on. Okay. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> My classmate is Olivia. Is Olivia? I don't see you. Olivia. Hi. Practice. Go ahead. Hi. Hi. <clears throat> Hello. Hello. My name is Olivia. Osorio. Um. Hello. <laughs> uh, my favorite, my favorite day is Oli. Me gusta que me digan Oli. I am 40 years old. Um, I am a teacher. And uh, how about you? Okay, Olivia. How tell me about yourself, David? Okay, and I am David Perez. I have four years too. And I like the bit I like the basketball. I play with my son and I am living in Madapan City. And you? Where do you live, Olivia? I'm, I, I live in San Bartolo, San Salvador. Okay. Uh, I am married and have a son. And you? I have a one son with me. One song. Me too. Okay, only that. <laughs> okay. Um. <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay, nice. nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Awesome. That is the that is the idea, right? That you guys speak like without you having planned anything, like improvising it. Okay, I gave you kind of like a guideline, but then at the end you decide what to say. Good. Anybody else? Thank you, David. Thank you so much, Olivia. Oli, you said who wants to go next? Volunteers. Volunteers. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Volunteers. As if you want to learn English. Come on. Raise your hand. Nobody wants to participate, come on. Okay, one thing, when you wanna say your age, you say I am, in my case, I am 32 years old. 
So you don't say I have, mm -mm, not possible. You wanna say I am blah, blah, blah years old. Don't say I have for your age. That is something that you have to remember. Sometimes we think in Spanish because your tengo is I have, we wanna say I have, but it's not I have, it's I am. Remember that. Okay, second practice for this, this uh, day. The second practice is this one. Let me show it to you. And, but let me ask you, how many of you know how to, um, let's say, how many of you know the entire alphabet? Do you know the entire alphabet from A to Z? Yes? Do you, do you know the alphabet by heart? How do you say the memoria in English? When you want to say the memoria, you say by heart. For example, how many of you know the alphabet by heart? from A to Z, yes? Are you okay with that? Okay, show it to me, please. This is our second practice. Let's see. Hello, good morning. My name is, what is your name? Hi, nice to meet you. My name is blah, blah, blah. How do you spell your name? And then you spell it. What about your name? And blah, blah, blah. Okay, so I need, volunteers to practice this. This time we are going to spell, okay? Spell our information, okay? So let's see, how do you say Jota in English? J. 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 How do you say uh, He in English? G. G. Okay. G. I need one volunteer to raise your hand and tell me the vowels. One volunteer to tell me the vowels. One. Thank you, Miguel. Go ahead. Hello. Hello. Good morning. My name is Miguel. What is your name? Um, Alfonso. Hi. Nice to meet you. My name is Alfonso. Do you spell your name? M A G U E L. Uh, can you tell me about your name? Um, okay, Miguel is his name of, of the angel. Thanks. Right, so that's, that's his example. Thank you so much, Miguel. Uh, I have a question. How, uh, because I saw some raise some hands up. What are the vowels? How do you say, what are the vowels? Can anybody say, you know, or pronounce them? The A vowels? I, O, U. Okay. A, A E, I, O, U. Okay, there you go. Good, thank you so much. So those are the vowel sounds. Why am I asking this? Because sometimes we tend to confuse the E in English with the I, right? And they say uh, A or I, and then we have to have this clear in our mind. The vowels are A, E, then I, O, U, okay? Remember that the letter, the letter E in Spanish, in English is I, and the letter A in Spanish, I mean, in English is E. So that, that confusion, just in case you, you still like doubt, so have that clear. Now, let me display once again this conversation. And I, this time I need volunteers. I just made a very quick, just made a very quick correction here because how was missing. Okay, I need now volunteers, but this time in pairs. Let me see, I want to display it. Who wants to help me? In pairs. Thank you, the light to participate. Okay, thank you. We have Emerson and Ana Maria Hueso. Can you see the screen? I think it's frozen. Yes. Go ahead. Hello. Hello. Mm. Okay. You can start. Hello. Good morning. My name is Anna. What is your name? Hi. Nice to meet you. My name is Emerson. And how do you spell your name? Yes. A. M A. How about your name? It's 
E M E R S O N. Thanks. Thanks. Okay, very good. It's very easy, right? See? My name is, yes, it's easy. <laughs> My name is A N A. What? So, <laughs> okay, now very good. I, I need one more participation. Okay, maybe we have Ruth, and who else wants to do it? One more volunteer besides Ruth? Anybody else? Uh huh. Okay, uh, Gilbert or Jacqueline. We have, I have Olivia. Okay, so Ruth and Gilbert this time. Let me display for you. One second, let me share the screen. Here we go. Let me see. Boom. That's it. Spelling. There we go. Go. Okay, first, uh, hello, good morning. My name is Alexander. What is your name? Hi, nice to meet you. My name is Ruth. How do you spell your name? It's A-L-E-X-A-N-D-E-R. How about your name? R-U-T-H. Oh, thanks. Awesome. Thank you so much. You want to add more information. That's really good. Because this is really easy, right? I appreciate it. <laughs> so let's see, Jacqueline and Olivia, go ahead, please. You are the, the last ones. You can start, Olivia. Hello. Uh, good morning. My name is Olivia. What is your name? My name is... Hi, nice to meet you. My name is Lauren. How, how do you? Um, how do you spell your name? O L I B I A. Mm -hmm. How about your name? J A C K Y. Thanks. I was expecting a J A C Q U E R, uh, and, and then you say Jackie. Oh, you see. Yes. <laughs> Easier, right? Okay. Um, thank you so much, Lourdes. Well, this is it, guys. I want you to please watch the video we have on the first lesson on the platform, and it says introducing themselves, right? Uh, please call me Beth. I want you to watch this video and then tomorrow we're going to practice about it. So please make sure you watch the video and try to practice it okay, as much as possible. Before we go, I want you to take a look at this, um, the possessive adjectives. It's like two minutes. Tomorrow we're going to start with this topic. So what are the possessive adjectives? Do you know the possessive adjectives, guys? What is the possessive adjective of I? What is it? Was the possessive uh, of I? Yes. My. My. What you about think? you? Yes. Your. Your. Good. What about uh, for we? What is it? Oh. Our. 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 We can say our. our, 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 or our, right? Basically, when we our. speak really fast, we say our, our, like that. And what about for she? What is it? Her. 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 I, think you are, I think you are very familiar with this so that, that is really cool so tomorrow we're going to review the conversation about please call me Beth is it has to do with what we just practiced which is introducing yourself and asking how to spell names and we are going to start uh, with examples about adjectives I mean possessive adjectives just for you to know we have these are the ones based on the video Okay, as you just mentioned it, my, your, his, her, it's, <laughs> are, and there. If you already know about this, perfect. You just need to go ahead and create some sentences and examples using these structures, okay? <clears throat> Do you have any questions, guys, before we finish today's session? Any questions or any participation that you want to add? Yes, David? Eh, eh, perdón, que hable un poco en español. Eh, soy nuevo y eh, no mucho lo, lo de la plataforma. ¿Hasta qué lección vamos a llegar en la plataforma? Plataforma tiene cuatro secciones. 
Y vamos a ir viendo por ejemplo, la esta primera semana. parte. Esta semana vamos a ver les, por menos, la primera la primer parte. Si gusta, le voy a mostrar. Tenemos más o menos el calendario que le mostré al principio. Eh, sí, porque va por, va por creo, por. Bueno. Semana. Va un... numerado, creo. 1. Punto... Sí, David. Entonces, esta semana, semana 1 y semana 2, la misión es esta. Miren, secciones 1, 2, 3 y el midterm. O sea, que esta semana ¿verdad? tendremos de cubrir por lo menos la sección 1 y la, por lo menos un poquito más de la 2. Yo les voy a ir guiando para que... Oh, es, la sección es, completa 1. 1 y ya iniciando la número 2 esta semana. Hay que completarla. Entonces, si usted, puede, si usted puede adelantar, guys, si puede adelantar, excelente. Go ahead and, and, and anticipate. ¿verdad? Si no, yo voy a ir tratando de siempre llevarlo para que el jueves ya hayamos cubierto lo que tiene que cubrir ustedes hasta el viernes, con todo, ¿verdad? Ya, okay. ojalá. Thanks, teacher. Así que mi invitación es, vaya, este tipo de programas es muy, le apuesta muchísimo a ser autodidacta, ¿verdad? Yo vengo a las sesiones, usted trae sus preguntas listas y las aclaramos, y si tiene alguna pregunta específica de algún ejercicio, vaya a ese ejercicio y me trae anotado, me dice, que ese ejercicio no lo entendí, lo hacemos aquí en la clase. Así, yo voy a hacer siempre esos espacios para que usted pregunte y pues tomemos ventaja de estos 60 minutos, que es bien poquito, ¿verdad? Pero practique, no se quede callado ahí, ¿ok? Entonces, agradezco muchísimo por the chance to be your teacher um, and see you tomorrow, ¿ok? Try to rest, it's already 10, I think. Bye bye. Bye bye. 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 See you tomorrow. Bye, see ya. See you. See you tomorrow.